He was hollering. Eyewitnesses are providing new details after a man dies after being tased by Kansas City, Kansas police. Detectives say the man was fighting with officers and paramedics outside of a family dollar store near 13th and Quindaro. KMBC 9's Eli Rosenberg live in Kansas City, Kansas tonight. All new at 9. Well, guys, police here not saying much about this man, only that he's a white male in his mid-30s, and he became combative as they try to load him up into an ambulance. Meanwhile, one witness tells me he still can't believe what he saw, adding he knows firsthand what it's like to be tased. He didn't tase him at first. He kept pointing at him. As investigators did their work under a warm afternoon sun, they was like, tase him, tase him, tase him. Marquis, so who didn't want to show his face, I'm watching the whole thing. explained how it all went down. Police say a city crew working nearby called 911 after a man started acting bizarre, including trying to get into this van and another vehicle. Police and EMS responded. Investigators say the suspect started to fight. Possibly getting loaded into the EMS or on the gurney. Uh, possibly getting on the gurney is when he became combative. Pop! Electric sound pop. Marquis watched before. as the man was then tased. I've been tased before, so I know what it said. In, 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 and they was he was hollering, oh, 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 he was hollering. And I was just like with a question mark over my head, like, wow, I'm like again. Residents sick of scenes like this, especially around here. It's always this 13th Street area where negative things are always happening. Now, a police spokesman at the scene tells me he does not believe this man was handcuffed prior to any of this. The man's identity has not been released. Live in KCK, Eli Rosenberg, KNBC 9 News. A police spokesman telling us the officer involved will not be put on administrative leave per department policy.